Welcome back, everybody, to a brand new episode of Final Fantasy Adventure. I'm your host, Wild Cloud, and today we're going to be saving my girlfriend from the evil vampire... Oh, the evil Ket's uh, castle lair thing. But yeah, uh, today we're going to be trying to get my girlfriend back, and we're going to be uh, facing off against a few new enemies. Uh, before we head into, uh, I believe, a new location. So, let's get started. Alright, so where I last left off was uh, the Marsh Hydra Cave, and I defeated the the Marsh Hydra and secured the Magic Mirror, which I need to get past the dude uh, to get through that door. And then I also uh, learned a new spell, and just fire. I don't know what happened to Cure, I guess... I guess cured. Okay, it's still there. All right. It just depends on which, what uh, spell you use. I enjoyed the last series of Final Fantasy Adventure a lot. Uh, it was just so much fun to play through and see all this old storytelling that uh, from the 90s. You know, like that's awesome. It's awesome to see what Square Enix used to do before they were even known as Square Enix, because they've made some of my favorite games. You know. They've made Kingdom Hearts, Final Fantasy. I had no idea what Secret of Mana was before I heard about Final Fantasy Adventure. There we go. Level up. Uh, let's see. We're gonna select um, Wisdom this time around. And it's just because I wanna be able to use uh, my magic a bit more. We got the sickle. Well, we also got the the battle axe last episode, but we got the sickle which cuts plants, and the battle axe actually cuts trees down. I don't think there's any trees that I know about that um, lead to any anywhere special, but uh, maybe I'll find out. I don't know. Let's go through here, and now we have to show this guy the magic mirror. So let's equip our mirror. That that mirror. I think he's a is he a werewolf? Is that what he is? I have no idea. Okay, there we go. One big con to this game is the fact that you have to save manually all the time. If you forget to save manually, it doesn't matter you will basically die if you die and you'll be put back to whatever save you had made previously oh i died wait a minute no Oh, son of a bitch, dude. I didn't save. Always remember to save in this game. Holy sh**. They got me tripping balls, dude. It doesn't matter if you did something amazing and great and completely, you know, changed the, the way the game is played. You know, like, you're on chapter 2, you're on chapter 3. It, it doesn't matter. You go back to your original save. There is no auto-save. Unfortunately, this happened with me, and I lost, uh, uh, well, I didn't l lose footage, I still have the footage, I just chose not to use it. So, um, I'm going to be fighting this vampire dude for the second time. No, no, I'm supposed to go... Through this wall right over here, so, equip the Madoc... Oh, I need a Madoc. Okay. That sucks. Alright, go through here. Again, go up here. Over 
worms and pass these creatures. Oh, you little bastard. Leave me alone. These guys look very familiar. I don't really care. Oh, there's a level up. Level 11. It's locked, so we take out. We got the chain. All right, now with the chain. Pull ourselves to freedom. Now, many of you may be wondering, uh, what is up with your colors? How did you get the colors like that? And I'm going to explain it to you. The colors are actually, uh, like there's a palette already. And it wasn't colored in the original game of course, uh, because it was like 1991, there weren't really colors on on uh, on consoles, really. But I mean, there were. It's just there weren't any co uh, colors on on the console that uh, the Final Fantasy Adventure came out on. So, uh, but there is a a it's a stereo palette. So there's like black, white, gray, and then lighter gray. And what I did was I just change those into actual solid colors like blue green brown uh red uh pretty much like a pink and then a really dark red that looks more like a brown and that's what you're seeing and i think that looks a lot more interesting than just having a gray screen uh because gray is is uh is just not fun to look at of course i don't mind it i could have played this game with a gray screen it doesn't matter to me but I understand a lot of people don't want to see just gray through an entire playthrough, especially when this is like the first Secret of Mana series game. Like, why would you want the first Secret of Mana series game to be gray? Do I not have my Matic equipped? No. My automatic? I don't know why they can call them picks or anything like that. I guess it's bad translation. I think it's this way, actually. I believe I use my mattock on that and go down here, go up through here. God, this is such a big winding dungeon. Okay, got to take out my key. Should be in here. There we go. Rona! Oh, wild! Let's get out of here. All right, yeah, let's let's get out of here with my new vampire girlfriend. Up through here. This game was really brutal. Uh, the difficulty was much harder than Hyrule Fantasy, just because you have to make your way through these dungeons without any sort of map. And in order to do that, it's just basic going back, looping around, having to start from the beginning because you fell down a hole or you went the wrong way and did a circle around. This game definitely had uh, some of the hardest dungeons I've ever seen on an adventure game. Up oh, here it is. That's my victim. Play the victim and you will be the victim. Here we go. Come on. This screams Castlevania. This literally is just like, hey, hey, we know what Castlevania is. We're copying it. Hey.
definitely gotta watch your health when you fight this guy. Get over here! Come on, where are you at? Come out so I can kill you. Oh man, this guy is playing. There we go. Oh. Defeated vampire. Receive the magic book of sleep. Learn slept. Are you alright, Rona? Yeah. Awesome. Wendell is to the south. Let's hurry. And we leveled up. Nice. We uh, level up stamina. Alright, she said let's hurry, so let's get out there. So, I need to equip this sickle to get through here. And then I have to go over here, and then I have to re-equip the chain. Oh, I didn't want to use that, but alright. And we made it to the town of Wendell. Nice. Welcome to Wendell, the sacred town. The waterfalls make all of our rivers flow. The water springs from the root of the tree of mana. Mana is supporting our nature. So, the mana tree creates water, I guess. It's pretty interesting. Alright, I believe this is where I need to go. Straight to the temple. Is there any... I don't think there's any secrets in here, no. Who's this guy? Oh, it's Kibba. Yeah, we're looking for. I am Kibba. Bogar told me about you. Oh, yes. It sure is the symbol of mana. Step forward. You'll see what you must see. What is what does that mean? What, wait, what? She'll see what she must see. Can she do this nowhere else but in this sacred temple? I guess so. I don't I have no idea how this game works. They don't ex really explain much. They do have an interesting story, though. Rona, my dear. Mom! Mom? That lady. She's the one who encouraged us. I must tell you now, Rona. You and I are the members of the Mana family. It's pronounced mana. We are the seeds of the mana tree. We must guard it. Vandal abused the power of mana a long time ago. So I sealed the waterfalls with that pendant. So that nobody can come close to the mana tree. But again, Glaive is trying to use it for evil. Guard the mana tree with the Geminites. Mother's figure disappeared. She's not my mother. Mom. Glaive is attacking us! What? I'll take you to a safe place. Thank you! Where did he take her? I'll check. He, he attacked me from behind. Ha! Gay! Rona! It was Julius all along. Why? You helped me once before. So he was that dude back in the marsh. Oh my god. I, real I, I just figured it out. I was not sure if she was the right girl or not until I saw what happened inside there. I was waiting for this chance to get her. And now... Glaives have her in our hands. Rona! That's why he wasn't throwing fireballs at the Hydra. He wanted me to die. You have no chance against me, my dear. Ha! Gay! Rona. My first girlfriend already gone. 
Wait, no. I've already said this. All right. Kibba, everybody. Kibba. Rona, where is she? Julius took her to the west in his airship. I'm going. Then take this with you. Receive the magic book of heal. Learn heal. This magic will help you recover. Thanks. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. I certainly did. We took on uh, the vampire lord boss guy. Yeah, he's dead now. Uh, we saved my girlfriend, alright. Um, but she uh, got taken away again, so I don't know. Um, I guess that's, that's how it goes. That's how it be, but... Uh, we'll get her back. Uh, we just need to travel to a foreign land um, with an unknown means. I have no idea how. But yeah, it's going to happen. Don't worry. Uh, if you like the video, please let me know. Comment, like, subscribe. And I'll be seeing you in the next episode. Peace out, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I work hard on these and I really appreciate all the support. Uh, I'm going to be making in the future more uh, retro adventure games. I really just focus on adventure games because it's in my opinion they're the most fun to do. So you probably won't see me doing something like Pong or, or Mario. Uh, I might do a few you know little uh, one-time videos just to review a video game but I really like uh, Pokemon, Legend of Zelda, Final Fantasy, uh, Secret of Mana, things like that. So anyways, I hope you all have a great day. Uh, check out my other videos, and I'll be seeing you later.